the first edition of Sketches Between the Persian Gulf and the Black Sea by Robert Clive. I'm Adam Douglas, Senior Specialist in Rare Books at Peter Harrington, and I'd like to show you this uh, beautiful uh, lithographic plate book. If I open it here, we can see the title page, Sketches Between the Persian Gulf and the Black Sea. Um, there was another issue of the book, which we don't know which uh, order it was done, but uh, with a slightly variant title. So sometimes it's hard to find this book in library records because it's a rare book. So uh, one needs to check how many libraries have it to realize how rare it is. It's published by Dickinson Brothers, well-known London lithographers in 1853. And this copy is really rather special in its binding and provenance. That's a uh, beautiful olive green Morocco for the Duke of Northumberland, the fourth Duke of Northumberland, who was a young man as Lord Prado had toured the Middle East and retained a lifelong interest in the Middle East. He was friends and patron of uh, Lane, the great Arabist, and had met Champollion and the other Egyptologists. Uh, he retained a lifelong interest in his collections now at the University of Durham. This uh, beautiful binding, very sumptuous with these lovely uh, wide inner dentels all round, very grand. It was done for him by uh, John Clark, who was one of the leading London binders of the era. And of course, it's uh, all edges gilt. Very handsome volume indeed. Uh, the lithographic plates are an unusual part of the world, and I can show you those. Uh, these are tinted lithographs showing scenery of a part of the world that the English hadn't seen very much of to date. Uh, these are quite inaccessible regions and of course they've uh, changed greatly in recent years. Uh, so this is a valuable record of uh, the, this area of the world from the Persian Gulf out across uh, the Levant towards the Black Sea. Uh, some of these lithographs have got a little bit of foxing here and there. But it's such a rare book. Um, that's a forgivable flaw, we think. And uh, really remarkable views of this part of the world. So for more details on this lithographic plate book and others of the region and others of this technique, please see the Peter Harrington website.